How do rock climbers climb so fast? All right, well, we have two sporting ladies on the show. So this one should hopefully come a bit naturally to you guys. The question is, how do rock climbers climb so fast? What are your thoughts, Lauren? Well, I think they need lots of muscles in their legs and also grippy shoes just in case they slip. Yep. And they need chalk on their hands because your hands get really sweaty while you rock climb. Have you done it before? Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, and they do get super sweaty, don't they? Yeah. So that helps, obviously, you stick to the rocks as you're climbing up. Yeah. So that's bottom half. Do you think yeah. you need a lot of upper body strength, though, Emily? Yeah, definitely. Um, in your arms especially and also for the technique with your gripping your hands. Yeah, absolutely. There's a lot of technique that comes into play. Can we all show off our, uh, our biceps right now? Woo! I think they might come into play because to check out if we've got this one right, let's head out to meet today's Brain Buzz guest. And I'm excited because today's Brain Buzz guest knows a lot about rock climbing, it's probably fair to say. Louis, thank you so much for joining us. You are an instructor, so I'm guessing you know your way around this thing? Yeah, I certainly spent a bit of time rock climbing, so spent a bit of time on the wall. Yeah? How yeah. many years all up? Uh, about 10 so far. Wow. So. You know your stuff, a decade rock climbing, yeah. got it. But you are here to help us answer our first question, which is, Emily? How do rock climbers climb so fast? Wow, well, we're climbing. It, uh, it's a pretty holistic activity, so it involves a lot of strength, you know, you need some flexibility. Uh, you also need a bit of mental toughness as well. And uh, climbers climb fast generally by improving their technique. So there's a lot of things you can do in terms of the balance and the way that you position yourself on the wall that makes you climb a lot more efficiently. Gotcha. And when we're talking about handholds and stuff, is there a better way to do it? Yeah, well, I mean, sometimes, you know, you might have to put your hand in an awkward position. Um, but the most important thing to remember is to try and keep your arms as straight as you can. So if you're climbing and you want to put your feet on the wall, it's best to bend your knees rather than bend your elbows. Okay. Hear that, girls? Yeah. Bend your knees rather than your elbows. What happens if we fall? Well, I mean, fear of falling, it's natural. You know, everyone feels that from time to time. Um, but on a rock climbing wall, especially one like this, you're very safe. We have lots of safety equipment and your harnesses that can keep you safe when you're climbing. Absolutely, we've got helmets. And this is hydraulic as well? Yeah, that's right. So there's a whole hydraulic <laughs> system behind here keeping you guys coming down nice and slow. Nice and slow indeed. OK, well, does anyone here have a fear of heights? Nope. No. Great, let's send them up, Louie. How do Fantastic. we do this? All right, well, let's get you guys hooked up. OK. Sure. Now. Uh, you've done this before, haven't you, yes. my friend? Lauren, okay, so she's she's got the experience. Let's see if she can deliver, because we're going to race it to the top. And you're both cheerleaders, so I'm expecting some, you know, I don't know, splits at the top. Do you reckon you can do that? Yeah. Should we give him a three, two, sure. one? Yeah, sure. All right, three, three two, two, one, go! go. <laughs> oh, look at the vigour. Both off to a flying start. I know, the fierceness of this. Ah. So how's the technique here, Louis? Yeah, these guys are doing really well, especially for beginners. You can see, um, still got a few bent elbows, so if you guys want to try and keep your straight arms now. straight, bend your knees, but other than that, they're doing great. I don't even think Lauren's looking for the footholds. She's just spider monkey yeah. on the wall. As strong as she is, I don't think you even need them. Yeah, look at her go. Oh, she's, she's coming up. She's oh, claiming, she's trying to claim that first place. I mean, Emily's got it right now. How are you feeling, Emily? Good! You gonna do a round off back handspring from up there? No. No, oh, probably not. <laughs> I really wanna see some cheers. Yeah. Whoever wins has to cheer for us up the top. Maybe on the way down. Oh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> they just can ride that hydraulic all the way down yeah. and give us a cheer. Well, I think that's official. Emily took out the win! Yes, well done. All right, girls. Congratulations. Fly on down like spider monkeys. Oh! She did, she did the split. Yeah. That was amazing. So, for first timers, Louis, pretty good. Yeah, incredible. Fantastic. Amazing. A couple of future rock climbers. Cool. Exactly. Uh, you don't have any openings <laughs> at the moment for instructors? No, I don't want them to put me out of a job. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Okay, well, let's unclip these gals. Come on through, and I'm going to squeeze over this way. High fives everywhere, ladies. Well done. You came very close second. Thank you so much to you, Louis. But right now, we. I've got to leave you here, but don't you dare go anywhere because coming up next, Claire is taking to the treetops all in the name of science. Plus, I meet a man who can ride himself around a mountain before breakfast. And it's not Louie.